I select OBD2. This goes through these different protocols and detects which one is on this vehicle. And then here there is a summary, it tells you if uh, any codes are found. DTC stands for Diagnostic Trouble Codes and there is one uh, also referred as Fault Codes. Readiness completed uh, is 9 and not completed is 0. This is important because if you have readiness not completed, if you have uh, more than uh, one or two here, that means that uh, the battery was either just disconnected or you erase the codes and if you have uh, numbers here not ready or not completed you cannot take your car for a uh, state emission test because it will fail and I'll tell you to just go drive the car a little bit more and come back in a few days we'll, uh, we'll press ok to confirm and then here we can read codes or rate codes check emission readiness um, look at data stream freeze frame oxygen uh, two sensor test there's more on this AVAP system test but we're gonna focus on reading and clearing codes in this case we go to read codes and then you can see uh, cam traffic position sensor circuit rage performance bank one or single sensor so you can write that code the code is right there the code uh, you once you write it down you can go ahead and do some research and see what that means for your particular make and model and over here you can see how many codes we have this is just the same code but it's shown twice right here uh, the once uh, once you review all the codes the arrows here you can press escape and then uh, now once you do have the codes and you find out what the problem is and you do fix that then after that you'll come back in here and uh, plug in the scanner it will power on again and then you uh, this time you go to erase codes and then it says clear reset emission related diagnostic information are you sure I'll say okay if you do clear the codes without fixing the problem what will happen is the check engine light will uh, come back on sometimes you can come back right away or sometimes you can take a couple two three days for it to come back on if you erase codes without fixing the problem uh, also keep in mind that your vehicle will not you can't take it for an emission test right away because uh, all these right here emission readiness they'll be not ready um, so if, if you go here and see you can see these monitors are all okay but if they're if they say not ready uh, then you won't be able to pass a mission uh, so anyway that's it as far as reading and clearing codes